Hello and welcome back to uh, Final Fantasy VIII with me, Matthew Caddis, Iggy Puggy. So, we're going to face, I guess, an optional boss, but one that, <coughs> that is worth your time, I guess, because it's another GF. Remember the magical lamp that Sid gave us? Well, we are going to face GF Diablos now, of course. Um, you can do this at any time, but I wanted to wait because, well, not too long because of the level level up thing in this game, so yeah. The main problem with Diablos, aside from how much HP he's got, he's got quite a lot, is that he uses gravity spells. Now, Demi, to be fair, does not kill you. It does not kill you in this game, and it hasn't done in many other Final Fantasy games. Though it does, if you have a high amount of HP, take a lot off. Seriously, so yeah. I do have a couple of regions. He does also attack you physically with his claws, so be careful of that. I definitely want to use Shell against this guy because of that. And also protect a bit later. Um, although, if you do, do wait a bit longer, you will get a um, GF um, towards the end of Disc 2, if you're playing this on the PS1 or PS2. Um, um, that will automatically give you both double and triple. Um, so yeah. Um, the other attack he uses is another gravity-based attack, which I do want to stick around for. Um, at least in this fight, even though it took me about 13 minutes to fight this guy. Never mind all my preparations beforehand, finding healing magic and everything just to deal with Diablos, of course. Um, so yeah. If you do get him early, however, he starts at level 9 with Diablos. The no, that was Demi again, wasn't it? Yeah, sorry. I thought it was his other move, but no. Uh, region is probably a good idea, actually, especially when he uses his really big move on you, seriously. Again, I'm, I'm, I haven't resorted to using the uh, thing, but never mind that. And yeah, that, that attack there where it just charges forth can easily um, um, do a lot of damage there. I don't know if it overcomes Protect, actually. If it does, then that, that will be a problem, especially earlier on in the game. Granted, there is a cheat which I do use quite a bit later in the game um, for invincibility and uh, enabling your limit breaks, seriously. Because some of the layer bosses at higher levels are just so tough. Again, I could have done the whole triple triad thing and just done that, but no, I didn't. Um, so yeah. There's his old. No, it's still Demi. Interestingly, Shell does protect against that magic. Um, I think it does about half of your HP, but I'm not sure. So yeah. But, um, definitely want to use, um, double there. Maybe protect or sleep. Status elements don't usually work on bosses, with the exception of a small few. I mean, um, seriously. Um, I mean, meltdown is a status element, which I will definitely use a bit later. Uh, but not until later, mind. Um, so yeah. And no, don't use the brothers on him, he's flying, so um, Earth will not work on this guy, seriously. And if we don't get Quake in this game, we only have the brothers for that. Oh, wait, no, we do get Quake. It's very different, though, to how it is. It's an all-attacking spell. Okay, there's the move I was talking about. Gravija, I believe it is. Um, which, um, oh, Gravija. I don't know, I don't know. G is silent or not, or like a H, but um, yeah, basically it, it does a lot of damage to your party, so yeah, really annoying to deal with. Meanwhile, seemingly Diablos is uh, mostly patient, or maybe not, yeah, I mean it does about 200 
300 damage with um, the shell in play. Without it, it does a lot more. Seriously. <clears throat> so that being said, that's basically his moveset. He does not use his really big move like with... I know a lot of GFs don't do that. I think that's only in, in Final Fantasy X where uh, you actually see the Aeons, as they are in that game, um, use their really big moves against a, like a human character, in this case, Yuna. Uh, so, yeah. Um, but that is because um, other summers um, also gain the thing, so yeah. Other than that, um, I don't know, Kuraga. That, I don't know. Seriously. But, um, that's basically the boss fight, I guess. After a while, um, he will say the words, uh, too much sleep, too weak, and the battle's over. Seriously. Um, he'll say that even at higher levels, even though, yeah. I didn't want to leave it too long with Diablos, though. Anyway, that's it. As I say, he starts at level 9, but the um, abilities you do get is pretty good. You get Time Magic Refine, and also, if you don't like battling all the time, the Encounter None ability. Seriously. The ability which can be good in certain areas, such as, um, well, um, the island closest to Hell, for example. No, I do a bit of level grinding there and find something and pull the Viathan, seriously. He's at the brunt of uh, Diablo's assault. Anyway, I'll see you on the next one. Goodbye!